Well, the union representing JCPS bus drivers warned us the first day of school was going to be troublesome, a nightmare. Travis Breeze checked back with Teamsters Local 783 to see if they think this four day break will fix any of the issues. Travis. Doug, Union President John Stovall says practicing the routes for four days will not work. JCPS says they are looking at every route and stop to ensure efficiency. Stovall believes there will have to be a lot of changes to fix things by Monday. And when they were calling me in tears crying that this is not going to work, and they were afraid they were going to get blamed. John Stovall knows saying, I told you so, won't do much at this point. No, because it doesn't really solve anything. His drivers had been practicing the routes before Wednesday and telling him the lefts and rights didn't add up. Also, they were going all the way across town. I'd had like a driver drive out Willhoy compound, which is all the way out in the East End, all the way to Valley Station for one kit. These routes, designed by the company Alpha Route from Massachusetts, are at the center of the issue. According to a data privacy agreement between the two entities, JCPS hired Alpha Route in November 2022 and then filed an amendment in March of this year specifying that the company was supposed to optimize school bell times for $265,000. The district's head lawyer told us bus routes were a part of that. The district says Alpha Route has been called back in to fix the situation. The district invested, I guess, a lot of time and a lot of trust in this company, and it's apparent it's not going to work. Stovall says when the plan was initially released, several bus drivers quit, meaning they are still in a bus driver shortage. You had drivers transferring out. You had drivers uh, self-demoting, go to another department. You had drivers quit. And so now you're back to the same thing. He would not confirm if any drivers quit Wednesday night or Thursday morning. And as we just told you at the top of this newscast, UPS in Louisville is going to be meeting with JCPS to hopefully help fix this mess. A JCPS spokesperson told me if you've already submitted a bus stop request form, do not submit another one. Any changes to your kids route will be updated in the bus finder website and app. In the studio, Travis Breeze, WHAS 11 on your side.